These are the outer walls of the city that we suspect is the one that the Achaeans besieged. And they have these strange little offsets in them. And according to Homer, Patroclus three times tried to climb these walls, but three times was thrown down. They look climbable today. They would have been smoother. Uh, but it's, it's feasible to, to see him doing this. And this, this slope is quite, quite characteristic of this wall. Uh, again, it's, it's interesting that these sloping walls appear in the Iliad. So it's yet another clue that we're in the right place. Um, I was going to talk to you about the sense of duty to fight. Um, the Iliad is largely about people trying to persuade Achilles, the greatest of the Achaeans, to fight. And he keeps saying, no, I don't want to do it. And they try every trick in the book to get him to fight. They offer him tremendous bribes. At no point, though, you can read the Iliad and check, at no point does anyone ever appeal to his sense of duty. Now, you would imagine that in a, in a modern war, that's the first trick people would try. Oh, you have a duty to fight, you've taken the oath, or whatever it is. Think of your country, think of your king. At no point has anyone ever mentioned this to Achilles. And I think that's because he had no duty to fight. That just wasn't part of his culture. He was here for the booty. He was Achilles, sacker of cities. He wanted to capture women and gold and sail home a big hero. And he was in it really for himself and his men following him were hoping that with a good leader like him they'd get lots of booty because they'd all be entitled to a share. They had no sense of duty because there was no duty. They weren't sent here by their country. They weren't fighting on behalf of the people at home. Their homes weren't threatened. There was no duty to fight. In the Hollywood blockbuster Troy, starring Brad Pitt as Achilles, our hero leaps from the wooden horse to rescue Briseis in the nick of time whilst Troy is being sacked. I have a number of problems with this. Uh, one, all the legends agree that Achilles was dead before the wooden horse was ever built. Uh, two, Briseis wasn't a princess of Troy. She was captain in an entirely different city on the way to Troy. But three, and this is the biggie for me, that Achilles might go out of his way to capture or rape a woman, that's quite believable. But that he would risk all to save the life of a woman he'd only met a couple of days before... Hmm, how can I put this?